Welcome to the introduction to PM. In this video, we will shortly introduce what planned maintenance is and why and how we implement it. Total productive maintenance has eight pillars that are aimed at productively establishing reliability of machines. Planned maintenance is one of them. Planned maintenance, PM, is a systematic approach to establish and maintain optimal equipment and process conditions in an efficient and cost-effective way. It is the scheduling of maintenance activities based on observed behavior of machines, such as failure rates and breakdowns. By scheduling these activities around such metrics, the cycle of breakdowns and failure is broken, thus contributing to a longer service life of machines. The vision of the planned maintenance is to achieve and maintain zero failures at minimum maintenance costs, and it has a mission to improve technology, equipment reliability, and maintenance skills. Its objective is to systematically ensure effective asset care over the plant equipment and machines. Moreover, the planned maintenance is responsible for creating and documenting machine knowledge and setting standards, as well as for training, coaching, and supporting operators in the pursuit of their autonomous maintenance goals. The PM vision, mission, and objective can only be achieved through the creation and building of knowledge and skills amongst both maintainers and operators and the selection and application of the appropriate maintenance type to equipment. This cannot be done all at once. This would be too overwhelming, uncontrollable, and inefficient. Thus, the planned maintenance is implemented in six consecutive steps. The first step of planned maintenance is about evaluating equipment and understanding current conditions. Knowledge of equipment ranks and current conditions will help us in developing a strategy to achieve the planned maintenance goals. The next thing we need to do after we evaluate equipment and understand current conditions is to support operators' autonomous maintenance activities by restoring accelerated deterioration, correcting design weaknesses, and restoring equipment to its optimal condition. The third step of the planned maintenance is about building an information management system. In process industries, an enormous variety of equipment needs maintenance, and different processes require different maintenance regimes. Managing this colossal amount of information manually is impossible. The company must set a computerized data processing system consisting of Failure Data Management System Computerized Maintenance Budget System Spare Parts and Materials Control System Technical Information and Drawing Control System The fourth step of PM is building a periodic maintenance system. In periodic or time-based maintenance, Standby units, spare parts, inspection equipment, lubricants, and technical information such as drawings may be required to carry out the scheduled work. Maintenance work proceeds smoothly only if these resources are properly prepared in advance. So in order to achieve this, we need to have a periodic maintenance system in place. The fifth step is about building a predictive or condition-based maintenance system. While unexpected failures decrease once periodic maintenance is established, they still occur and maintenance costs may increase. This is because periodic maintenance is time-based and assumes a hypothetical rate of equipment deterioration. Optimal service intervals cannot be set without measuring the extent of actual deterioration in individual items of equipment. To address this problem, we need to have a condition-based maintenance system in place, which would allow us to identify which equipment or component needs to be maintained immediately. The final step is about evaluating the planned maintenance system. After we are done with the previous steps, we need to assess the maintenance system costs and their performance, and reconsider priorities if there are ways to improve them. To achieve the PM evaluation and optimization aim, it is necessary to implement the following core activities. Assess the planned maintenance system costs and performance and reconsider priorities. Evaluate the reliability and maintainability. Support maintenance crew know-how evolution with education and training. Evaluate the overall cost reduction. Thank you for watching the video. You have now finished the introductory session. Please go on to the PM implementation videos to learn more and get a detailed understanding of the planned maintenance.